like partners. You became the dynamic duo. Well, Red that Man was, and Meth, how did that come about? That was Kevin Lyles at Def Jam, you know what I'm saying? He um had the bright idea of putting us both on a tour together, Month of the Man. Now, Red Man being who he is, a real G, because he could have said no, you know? And that, that would have been that. But he, he was gracious enough to let me go out, us together on that tour. And the whole time, it wasn't no tour buses. It was 15 passenger vans. But it was just me, him, Shanita Floyd, and the driver. And we was going state to state. And back then, you had to freestyle at every end store. Some of y'all young dudes ain't got to go through that. We had to go to end stores, all kind of craziness. You had to freestyle all night and all this craziness. So in the midst of this doc, he like, yo, we need to do this song together, blah, 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 this, that, and the third. And we used to toy around with little hooks here and there, so I had to sneak off and do that. I told a story the other day. I think it was to the Dream. Um, uh, shout out to Fan Mio, F-A-N-M-I-O. They sponsor the show every single day. That's where you connect with your favorite rappers, athletes, artists, one-on-one. -on -one. Now. I told a story to, to uh, I want to see if you remember this. You don't remember it, you can say fine, you don't. Right. But I remember when we was in the ATL back in the days, they had like Jack the Rapper or something. Yeah. And we was in the front freestyling. Me, you, the whole world, everybody was out there from the school of that time. And I walked up with a red bandana with two guns in his hands in front of the hotel. I don't know if you remember this, but I'm going to tell you who. So we all looking like, who the f is this? And he's like, yo, crack, what up? But he still got the f So we looking at him, and he loaded his Tupac. Wow. You was wow. there. You was there. You was in the cypher. You was I missed there, it man. Then. I missed it then. Damn, you know, I used man. to blow. We was smoking um, dust. That's that the day. first time I ever seen Tupac. I ever met Tupac was there. And um, after that, I, I met him a bunch of other times. Right. But uh, that was the first time we was all out there. I remember the girl who used to sing uh, Snoop is on here. Do uh, you remember the girl who used to sing all of Death Rose in the House? Lonely. Jewel. Jewel. That was her name. Jewel. Oh, like that. Jewel. She was hanging out with us. She was hanging out with us out there, too, singing that shit. We had to sing that shit. Over and over again. She over there. That <laughs> frozen hell. Oh, me. there. Right. Oh. Um, um, Those were the days, so, boys. So that's <laughs> what happened. So y'all went on tour, and you and Red Man, y'all just clicked up so much that y'all said, let's, let's make music together. More doc than me because I still had that stipulation with RZA in them. You know what I mean? It was more or less like keep it in the family, this, that, and the third. And anybody know me, I'm very loyal to the crew. You know, it's like, yeah. But I, I had to sneak off and do that, too. We went all the way to Long Island. We did it in Mirror Image. Tommy Uzo, rest in peace. He just passed away, I think, yesterday or the day before. Brilliant engineer. Google him. He's done millions of records for everybody, from Michael Jackson to Red Man and Method Man. A lot of people, man. He's gone now, though. So I had to sneak off. And do this record with Red Man too, and who knew the thing done turned into a movie, a TV show. You know, we got a platinum record out of it. It's, it's just a blessing, man. I love that dude. Different he kind of energy. I love he Red Man too. Word. You know, I gave I gave Red Man my demo. Word. Yeah, he came. He came. You know, I was still in the streets. I made a demo with uh, Diamond. So Red Man came to perform at Club Two Thousand. Um, in Harlem, uptown, Washington Heights, and I went around the back. And when he came out, I was like, "Yo, my man, let me holla at you." Mm. You know how to do to us. Yeah. I played him. He sat right there, and I played him on the cassette. And he listened. He gave me love and all that. And then you know, he never hit you back. <laughs> you remember that? No. <laughs> like, nah. <laughs> I love Red it. Man. Yo, Red Man, yo, he's one of my favorites.